change. <laughs> so tell me, how is Mama, your brother? Mama, <gasps> she's fine. I mean, they're all fine. Mm. What can I say? <laughs> I trust you. I know you always take care of them. Of course. <laughs> Actually, and your face is so beautiful. Thank you. Yeah, you're making money. Which money? Anyways, thank you. Thank you so much for it. Let's see me stay here. Are you okay? Come on. You don't have to thank me. It's it's nothing. Hey. You're more than a friend to me. Look at you. You being... are my sister. Oh, am I? <laughs> <laughs> Look at you being all cute. <laughs> thank you. Love you. So, now that you're done with service, mm -hmm. are you ready for the labor market? Babes, I'm more than ready. Mm. I need to make money so I can take care of Mama and Junior, especially Mama. Yeah, I know. <laughs> that woman has tried for me a bit. <laughs> what? Don't worry, you'll get a job in no time, my God's grace. Oh, amen, amen, amen. I can't wait. <laughs> so, please call Mama and tell her you are with me. Mm. Mm. Mama's daughter. Mm. And come <laughs> into the room immediately. Oh, kiss. Let me call her before she start panning. Thank you, my darling. <laughs> hey, Mama. I've gotten to Shade's place, so she's been asking after you. Baby girl, look at you. You look so good. Ah, are you going to give people jobs or you're going to get a job? Oh, please, all this time. <laughs> you're looking like the CEO already. <laughs> you know what? Then? Just wish me luck, all right? You're not just lucky, you're blessed. Grace will speak for you today. Amen. <laughs> Thank you. All right? <laughs> So tell me, why should we employ you and not the other applicants? Um, <clears throat> though I can't speak on the qualifications of the other candidates, but I can definitely speak on the qualities that make me the best fit for this position. So I know that your company is looking to recruit very competent communicators and marketers that would help take this company to the next level and help it stand out amongst other competitors. So, I am that person. During my internship, while I was still at the university, I helped the company I was with grow their sales by 70%. And that was just by targeting social media advertising. So that is just one of the ideas that I have. So I promise you, if employed, I will definitely help move this company to the next level by boosting productivity, putting it on the map, and just helping it stand out. Please, just take a chance on me, sir. That's impressive. You sound so competent. Oh, sir, I am very competent. But the other applicants are also competent. But don't worry. I'll give you the job. What? Sir, so thank you. Thank you so much. God bless you. I'm so... Thank you. But there's a condition. Okay. So what's the condition? Just, you can tell me what you want. Like. You will be a private staff. Sorry, sir. Please. I don't understand. What do you mean, private staff? You'll be my girl. So, if I don't date you, I won't get the job? I'm, I'm sorry, sir, but I can't date you. So if you can't employ me based on my competence, then this company definitely doesn't deserve me. work. Stressful as always. What are you doing here? How did the interview go? Can you believe that stupid man? 
said I have to date him or he won't give me the job. What? He asked you to date him? What is wrong with all these employers? That's how they behave. They lose the good employees and choose the bad ones who agree to their terms. Did he even acknowledge the fact that I'm competent? Yeah, he had the nerve to ask me to be his private staff or his girl or something. It's his loss. Yeah, you're right. It's their loss. Come here. You get it at home, okay? You don't have to reach out now. Mama, I'm fine. How are you, Aunt Junior? Junior didn't go to school. Oh, school face. Mama, I'm so sorry, but I don't have money now. You know, I told you, it's my friend that's been feeding me. Yes. No, my even as I, that's exactly what I was doing, trying to apply. I've been applying. Nothing is coming. Eh, please just pray for me. Just pray for me to get a good job so I can take care of you and Junior. Amen. Thank you, Ma.
Hi. Um, hi. Um, I'm so sorry for staring at you like that, you know, but it's impossible for any man to see a woman as beautiful as you are and doesn't stare. Well, how may I help you, Mr... Oh, pardon my manners. My name is Abdul. I'm a photographer. I work with a modeling agency. And uh, our agency is currently looking for young, beautiful models like you. So I think you fit into what we're looking for. You have all the qualities that we need. Uh, Mr. Abdul, yes, right? Yes, of course. Abdul. Thank you. But I'm sorry. I don't have time for all these modeling agency scams. No, this is not scam, okay? I mean, it's legit. Okay, just hold them. I'm sorry. Here. Take it. We're having an audition next weekend, okay? So I'd like you to come around. The address is in the flyer, all right? Will you? I will be expecting you, okay? Okay, sister. Hi. Right. Bye. You didn't tell me you were into modeling. Huh? Oh, that. Some guy at the supermarket gave it to me. So, are you going for the audition? <laughs> Definitely not. Why? I mean, clearly because I'm not ready for all that modeling scam thing. <laughs> you go now and realize they're looking for girls to use for us. Shadi, I know I need money, eh? <laughs> but it's not that bad. And what if it's not scam? What if it's the dream job you've been waiting for? I cannot afford to waste my energy or the small money you've given me on transport for something that's scam. There's no way I'm going to that. Uh, advice you try. Mm
Firstly, we want to thank you all for coming out for this audition. Um, you're all extremely beautiful young ladies, but unfortunately, we've selected only four of you. Um, I'm going to call out the numbers of the ladies we selected, okay? Um, the first model is um, 095. 095. Congrats. The second model is um, 011. Congrats. And uh, the third model is um, 080. Yes. Congrats. And the fourth model, um, this decision, I think it was a bit difficult for us, but I think we are satisfied with the decision. Um, the fourth model is um, 101. Congrats. So um, for those of you that did not get selected, please, we'd love to see you next time. Uh, for those of you who selected, it's time to walk. Chop, chop. Shade? Obi! Oh my god! <laughs> good, long time. Yeah, thank you. And you look good yourself. Thank you. <laughs> so, where are you going? I'm heading home. I just want to get in the car. Alright, let me drop you. Go in with me. Let me drop you home. She didn't even ask if I am going your direction. Please, I insist. Your way is now my way, so I'll drop you home. I saw you. <laughs> I saw everything. You saw me. You saw me doing what? Oh, I saw you hugging that guy. Who is it? He's Obi. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Obi, my old cosmate. So you casually said it. Obi, my old cosmate. And you were busy hugging him passionately like there's no tomorrow. What are you talking about? What's the rest of the gist? <laughs> Guy. That guy has really changed the world. Uh -huh. yeah, back then in uni, he used to be so ugly. Like, ugly. For but now, reason? look at him. Yeah. Looking fresh like today's bread. <laughs> yeah, what I know is that money can make the ugliest person become the cutest person. And it obviously looks like he has money. So, I mean, expected, right? You're right. Yeah, but then I hope to God that he is single. <laughs> So that both of you can mingle. <laughs> I mean, you should have seen you guys. You guys look so perfect together. Purely mingle. Namigo. You're such a joker, girl. <laughs> but I'm serious, though. I mean, if he asks you out, won't you accept? Ah! All of a sudden, you stammer. <laughs> um. He hasn't asked me out yet, so when he does, I'll think about it. Liar. Liar, liar, pants on fire. You know, you and I know that you're jumping at it one time if he does that. I am not jumping at you anything. You are jumping at it! No! <laughs> Tell that can handsome. You want to think about what? Oh, the kids. What's here to watch? 
Jesus. <laughs> you haven't lost your sense of humor. You're still as funny as you were in the university. You haven't lost your beautiful smile. You know I had a crush on you back then in the university. Really? Yeah. My biggest you was have you as my girlfriend. So why didn't you tell me? I was scared. You're out of my league and I knew that I was just a broke uni band boy. Well you should have still asked me out. The least I could do was to say no. Exactly. That's what I didn't want. To. I did not want to tell me. It's never too late to chase your dreams. Are you speaking directly to me? No, I'm right here. You could just tell me. Just pray that I'm selected. Yes, yeah, so this opportunity can change our lives forever. Amen, amen. See, I promise, if I'm picked, I will build you a very big house. I'll take care of Junior, I'll expand your business. I'll do everything. <laughs> amen, amen, mama. <laughs> okay, all right, I'll talk to you later. smiling like this. That's the good news. <laughs> Obi asked me out. Okay. And I accepted. Hmm. <laughs> so much for, oh, I'm going to take my time. I'm not rushing anything. I want to think about it. You know, there's no rush. So much for all of that. All of a sudden, you actually have to accept it. You're not thinking about it anymore. I'm not thinking about <laughs> anything. Anyway, talk about I'm happy for you. Thank you, my love. <laughs> Thank you. So tell me, when are the wedding bells jingling? I don't <laughs> understand. Wedding bells just like that? Come on. Yes, there's no time. Oh. I don't want to rush in and rush out, so we're going to take our time. Oh, are you? Yes. <laughs> I was joking, I'm sure you know that. <laughs> yeah, so tell me, how was work today? Hmm. Work. Work is good, there's just so much going on. An American company reached out to my agency. They need a model for a gig, and it's such a big deal. Like, whoever wins will have to be flown abroad, get a, like, a whole proper deal. Get like so many privileges and it's a lot of money involved. Oh God, I just pray. I just hope and pray that I get picked. Babe, this is massive. I know, it is. Hmm. Oh, I just pray they pick me. You're getting it. Am I now? Yeah. I mean, I hope I do. So I need to go in. Thank you, question. Um, so... The client has chosen the model they want to use. Um, Candy, I know how hard we've worked on this project. I know how hard you in particular have worked on this project and you're looking forward to it. But 
unfortunately, they prefer using Lucia's face. <laughs> Are you joking? I'm serious. How can they choose Lucia over me? It's the client's choice. That's nonsense. Candy. I am better than her in every way. I'm more beautiful and more experienced. Please. How can you let this happen, Paula? How can you let her walk in here and take what's mine? Candy, I did Don't let Candy! Me. Candy! 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 For God's sake, what's that about? Ladies. I'm so sorry for that. It's alright. Thank you so much. Thank you. I'm sorry, okay? It's okay. Next time. There's always the next time. Sure. Anyway, Lucia, great news. Good news for you. Hope you're ready for the interview at the embassy. By God's grace, I am. You have nothing to worry about, okay? The client is going to make sure that you get the visa. You can be sure of that, okay? Don't worry about that. Uh -huh, I'm going to give you some number, or number rather, to call. Um, when you get there, he will make the, the, the process easier for you, okay? Thank you. Alright? You so You're welcome. Alright, scooch over. Let me show you some things in the file, okay? Like I said, to make the job easier for you. So this, right? No? Okay. When you get there. I have an extra job for you. Follow that car. Sorry, Lucia. Thank you. Please just, just help me up. I need to go for the interview. No, come on, you can't. You're badly injured. No, but, but I have to try. I can't let this modeling gig pass me by. Are you serious right now? The modeling gig should be the least of your worries. Can't you see you're badly injured? I know, but if I don't go to the embassy, I won't get the visa to travel. And if I don't get the visa, I can't get the gig that gives Lucia, me. Lucia, come on. You don't have to worry yourself about all of that, okay? All you need right now is maximum rest. That's okay? all you need? to God that you're still alive. <laughs>
guys, have you been able to tell the client that there will be some delay? you to eat and get it all for me. Lucia? What's wrong? I've, I've just been replaced another model. What? Um, um, Lucia, I'm so sorry about that. I'm sorry. Can you just stop crying? Stop. Don't worry. When you get well, you'll get a bigger gig. Okay? Ned, I just lost the opportunity of a lifetime. I can't even walk. What to talk of catwalk. Lucia, please. Can you just worry about yourself? Worry about leaving this place. Worry about getting well. <laughs> Lucia, it's okay. Please stop crying. You'll get back to work as soon as you get well, okay? It's okay. What's the point of getting well if I can't take care of my work? Can you just stop? I don't like this. I don't like to see you this way. It's okay. <laughs> good to be home, right? No. It doesn't. Stop talking like this, Lucia. Another opportunity will come. How? I mean, can't you see that I can barely even walk properly? Shadi? Do you know what this modeling gig would have done for me and the entire family? Would have taken us out of poverty. Hello, Mama. Yeah. I'm better now. I've been discharged. I'm back home. Yes, uh, as soon as I get better, I'll return to work. Amen. Thank you, Ma. Lose hope, Lucia. Another greater opportunity will definitely come. 
just focus on recovering properly, okay? Who are you? Ada. Ada, I am not your kid brother. Uh, you're just one year older than me, remember? One year, one month, one week, I'm still here before you. Whatever. You didn't tell me you're coming. Why would I tell you? If I had told you, would you let me come? <laughs> Sorry. Ada. Meet the love of my life, Shadi. Shadi, meet my sister who is just one year older than myself. It's a pleasure to meet you. Why didn't you tell me about her? Why would I tell you about her? All the first I told you about, you always found the way to break us up. It's all you do. Oh, please. Those girls, they were not good enough for you. They are all gold diggers. And I'm not even sure she's Stop. any different. Don't start. Don't even try it. Let's go to your room. I will show you to your room. Let's go. tell you directly that she doesn't like you. Stop jumping into conclusions. She doesn't need to. What does those girls are not good enough for you? They're all gold diggers and I am no different. What does that mean? It doesn't mean anything. It doesn't. Like Obi said, She's only being overly protective. So, it's left for you to prove to her that you're good enough for her brother. Oh, please, I don't like that at all. Like, I'm not ready for all this in love vibe. <sighs> Relax. I'm not, I'm not just ready for it. Relax. What's that? The, the agency. They fired me. Oh my god. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Mama? I'm fine. How are you and Junior? I'm still here. Oh, I still haven't gotten a job. Huh? He's sick? Taking him to the hospital. Uh, what kind of problem is this now? I don't have money to. Uh. Amen. How 
how is business, Mama? Okay. <laughs> I'm strong, and then I can walk. How can a sick person get a job? God help me. Maybe if I move around. To feel better, then I'll be able to get a job. Maybe. My promise, I will take care of you. continue to teach a student who is not ready to learn. I am tired. She is rude. She doesn't pay attention at all. No, please, listen. I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk to her now. I promise she'll change. Sir, I have been patient with her for three good months. Nothing has changed. She keeps getting worse. I'm sorry, sir. I can't. I quit. No. Pell, what is wrong with you? What is wrong with you? How long do you want to continue like this? Do you know if you feel these exams, you feel the way? Do you know? I don't care. Pell. You're on job hunting again. <laughs> what can I do? Anyways, this one, they said they have managerial positions, so I'm just trying to see what is possible. Okay, don't worry. You get one. Hello. How was work now? <sighs> Amazing. Right? Yeah. That reminds me. 
Can you do a home tutoring job? Babe, are you kidding me? I can do any kind of job. As long as it's legit, count me in. 100%. <laughs> okay, that's fine. I'll talk to my friend who owns a home tutor company oh. that you're interested. Thank you. Thank you so much. You're um, welcome. Can you please do that? <laughs> that I job. will. Come down. <laughs> okay. Babe, please. Can you can you do me a favor? Sure. What's that? Um. Can you give me like ten k? I need to send money to Mama so she can get drugs for me. Junior. You know? I'm sorry. I can't loan you ten k. Shabby, please. I know you've tried for me, but he's just he's so sick. Please, I beg you. I promise I'll pay you back as soon as I get a job. I just said I cannot loan you 10k. I'll gift you 10k. And please, can you stop asking me to loan you money? I've told you that when you need anything, just let me know. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're welcome. So, I just need to go in, freshen up. I hope there is something. Oh, trust me. Chef. <laughs> Chef Lucia. You know that. You know that. You know. So, is it Lucia or Lucia? Um, It's Lucia, sir. Lucia. So... Lucia, I hope you have a lot of patience. <laughs> yes. In fact, I'm a very patient person, sir. So. That's good. That's good. Pearl! Pearl! I want to introduce you to who you'll be teaching. My, my daughter. Pearl! Well, come. Well, I want you to meet your new home teacher. She's called Miss Lucia. Say hello. Um, hi, Pearl. I am Miss Lucia. I'll be your new home tutor. Nice to meet you. Well. Yes, I did. Wow, congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. So how old is the child? Uh, her name is Pearl and she's 11. 11, that sounds good. I don't think she'll give you so much trouble. I wish. With what I saw, looks like she'll be quite a handful. <sighs> so today we'll be studying Parts of speech. Parts of speech. Repeat after me. Parts of speech. The first one that we're talking about is the verb. Say verb. <laughs> um, Pearl, can you please put your phone away and concentrate? I said, please put your phone away and pay attention. Like, if you don't put it away, I'll have to report you to your dad. I don't care. Okay. I'll have to seize your phone if you refuse to put it away. You can't. Oh, you think so? I don't think so. I know so. You 
if you try to correct my phone, I'll tell my dad to fire you. If you like, concentrate. If you like, don't. It's wrong. You'll pay me at the end of the month. It's a loss. Let me talk this. Just, just rush. Pronoun. So with this, we'll come to the end of today's class. I will see you tomorrow. Um, make sure you do your homework. Thank you. How are you? How are you, my angel? Was she well behaved? Honestly, sir, she wasn't. She was more focused on her phone than what I was teaching her. Give me a second. All right, my little angel, listen. I'm not seizing it, I'm only keeping it, okay? And I need you to. Listen to Miss Lucia whenever she says pay attention, otherwise I'm going to take your iPad, I'm going to take your laptop. Okay. No, I feel bad for reporting It's okay. No, I was going to seize it anyhow, so um, it's fine. Um, okay. I'll get going on, sir. Sure. Seriously. Thank you so much. I'm, I'm really sorry about your behavior. It's, it's okay. You know, it's why I have to get a bit of patience. Enough of them, you know. I, I believe that. Yeah. 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 We're getting addicted. So, how's work today? <laughs> Way tougher than I thought. I don't understand. As a child, a slow learner. It would have been way better if she was a slow learner. That girl, she's a no learner. What do you mean? She's not interested in learning at all. More than half the time she was on her phone. She wasn't even listening to me. Mm -mm. What kind of nonsense is that? So what did you do? Well, I reported her to her dad. He seized her phone. No, I, I kind of feel bad about that. You should not feel bad. You did the right thing. Uh, hmm. Hopefully she gets better. I hope so. Anyways, how is Obi? Mm -hmm. Obi's fine. Right. Finally, his sister has gone back to Lagos. Hey, thank God. <laughs> <laughs> At least now you can breathe. She won't hmm. be there on your neck telling you you're not good enough for her brother. That no, girl no. is a bone in my throat. Well, your bone is out of the way now. <laughs> <laughs> you know how excited I am, eh? Hmm. I know, right? <laughs> yeah, I'm happy for you, too. Okay, so in the last class, we already spoke about uh, parts of speech. We spoke about the verb, pronoun, and the rest of them. Today, we'll be giving examples of each of the parts of speech, starting with the verb, right? One example of a verb is stand, another is move, another is eat. Yeah, you already know what a verb means, so do you understand me? So, do you understand? I'll have to report you to your dad again. I understand. Good. So since you understand, give us some more examples of verbs. <sighs> Run. Squat. That's nice. <laughs> but first off, before we move on from this, do you even know what a verb means? 
Yes. What's a verb? A verb is an action word or a doing word. Nice. Good job. All right, give me a high five. Okay, let's continue. Oh, examples of pronoun. Proud is a very intelligent young girl. But it seems like she's sad or angry about something or with someone. Do you know she's being bullied at school? Or anywhere else? No, no, no. She's not being bullied at school. But you're right, she's she is angry at someone. Do you know who? Yeah, I know who. It's me. She's angry at me. Why? <laughs> okay. So I... I used to be a drunk. I used to be an alcoholic. And my my late wife, she always used to complain and complain and complain. The more she complained, the more I drunk. I just wouldn't stop. Long story short, one day she got angry. Pissed off. She stormed out of the house. She got involved in an accident. And that's how we lost her. Since then, uh, Pell blames me for her death. And she's taking the anger out on everyone and everything. So sorry. God rest her soul. But then, it was an accident, right? I, I don't think it was your fault. No, no, it, it, it was my fault. I mean, if, if I listened to her, I, I wouldn't be drunk. And if I didn't get drunk, she wouldn't be angry. And if she wasn't angry, she would not leave the house. And if she didn't leave the house, she wouldn't have been in an accident. And if she was an accident, it, it's she would have okay. Been. She, right? It's it's okay. She would have been here with us right now. No. It's my fault. I'm so sorry. You know that's why Pearl behaves that way. That's why Pearl. Hey, where are you going? I'm going to ease myself. <sighs> okay. And you didn't deem me fit to take permission before going. You know what? Come and sit here. You go and ease yourself after the class. But I'm pressed. Then if you're pressed, you ask for permission properly. You don't just walk away. Okay. May I go and use the restroom? Okay. But don't be long, okay? Time in you.
true. This is the meaning of this now, Phil. Switch off that laptop and follow me downstairs. Now. If you don't switch off that laptop, I will Report make sure... it to my dad. The worst thing he can do is to seize my laptop. And that only make me hate him more. I know you're angry with your dad about what happened to your mom. But it wasn't his fault. It was a mistake. It was an accident. It's his fault. He caused it. If he had stopped drinking, she wouldn't have been involved in that accident. It's all his fault. I hate him so much. Girl. Don't say that. You see, in life, no one is perfect. We all make mistakes. Your dad made a mistake and he regrets it so deeply. He's very sorry too. Right? I know you're, I know you're angry. But guess what? Your dad is even more angry with himself. I know that you're hurt. And that's valid. It's understandable. But your dad is even more hurt. Like a friend would say, if only we could turn back the hands of time, we would do things differently. But we can't change the past. We can only change the future through what we do with the present. Your dad is trying so hard to redeem himself. Please. Give him a chance to right this wrong. You need to let go of the past so that you can embrace the future. Well, you, you have such a bright future ahead of you. Don't let the weight of the past hold you down. Please. Great profession. Really nice. And a model. Really? You know, Miss Lucia used to be a model too. Really? Mm -hmm. Then why did you stop? Um, Sorry. What happened to you? Were you born like this? No. I was involved in an accident. Oof. Sorry. 
That's okay. <laughs> can you teach me how to cut book? Oh, sure. I would ask your dad if I can come tomorrow. Okay. Oh, welcome, sir. Thank you. Welcome, Daddy. Thank you, darling. How are you? I'm fine. How was work? Work was fine. Dad, can Miss Lucia come tomorrow to teach me how to cut work? How to what? Cut work. Cut work? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Well, sure, um, if, if she has time, why not? Okay, Daddy. I'll be in my room if you need me. All right. What is happening? What did you do to my daughter? Well, I, I talked to her and made her realize that you love her. And that what happened to her mom was an accident. Thankfully, my words permeated her heart, and here we are. <laughs> Just like that? Just like that. Miss Lucia, do you have any idea how long I've been through? Oh my god. This means the world to me. You have no idea. I'm glad. <laughs> Listen, I've been trying my best to make peace with my daughter for crying out loud. Just one day. <laughs> You said you loaned some money from the bank. Yeah, I did. So I could get these dollars reported into the country. Mm, okay. So how much is it? Three hundred million naira. What? Three hundred million? Babe, yes, that's babe. huge. I know it's huge, but this is it. If I sell those goods, I'll make twice the amount of profit. Okay. That sounds cool. Sure. sure. So why are you worried? I use all my property as collateral. So if anything happens to those goods, I'm doomed. God forbid. Nothing will happen to those goods. You will get your goods and you will sell them with ease, by the grace of God. Amen. Thank you so much. Okay. Wow! 
Well, look at my daughter. My daughter is now a supermodel. I was supposed to take you to France or something so you can go model for the whole world to see, right? Yes. Hey, wow. And it's good to see you smile again, pal. Come here. I'm so sorry for everything, okay? I love you, okay? I love you too, Dad, and I'm sorry too. All right. Now you can have your phone back. Yay! Thank you, Daddy. It's on my bed. Okay. Thank you, Daddy. Hello, Miss Lucia. I am I'm calling to tell you that I have made peace with my daughter. And this wouldn't have happened without your help. I want to say a big thank you. I'm very, very, very appreciative of this. God bless you. You have no idea what it means to me. I am... I, I'm... I'm going to send you salary and a, a little gift with it, okay? Thank you so much. We'll, we'll talk later. Bye-bye. <laughs> Madam, why are you not back yet? Hmm. So he took it out on a date. Now from club did he take enter dance? Very soon he will take you out without pearl. I don't understand. You know chop for where you go. I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg. No, you don't disturb me. Babe, person carry you go restaurants for chop. Order for what you want to eat and eat. Don't disturb me. They the hunger go kill you. Hmm. All right. See you later.
Hello, Chief was good evening. How are you doing? What? How? How? When? Oh no, I'm finished. I'm. I'm. Oh. Ah. Babe, what was that? Talk to me. What happened? The goods I I'm shipping in so just right now. What? Ah God. Didn't you insure it? Baby, there's no insurance. There is no, there's no insurance. How can you not insure? What are you talking about? I, I don't know. I... You know what? Babe, just calm down, okay? But you need to call Chip. Call Chip with a back to the permit. Baby, his number is not going through. It's, it is not connected. Then you, okay, Gina, we need to go and confirm this. We need to go and confirm it. You don't just... Let's go. Let's go. Get into the car. Get into the car. Let's go. Okay, get into the car. Let's go. Get into the car, let's go. I am so sorry. Good afternoon. I'm so sorry. I forgot to call you to tell you she went to her grandmother's. Oh, wow. And I'm so sorry. I should have told you that. Oh, it's my goodness. It's fine. It's fine. When is she back? She will be there for a couple of days. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Please just call me when she's back. No. Uh, uh, let me just give you at least for uh, your leg transportation at least. Okay? It's fine. You don't have to worry. It's no, fine. I insist. I insist. Please. Please. Okay, something. My bag is upstairs. Okay. okay. I'll be right back. Thank you. Miss Lucy, I'm so sorry. I don't I don't want an envelope. I don't want to put in your bag. So this is too much. You, no, you no, have to. No, 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 Miss Lucy, it's my fault. I should have called you. I didn't. You came all the way here. Oh. No, come on. There's nothing really. Thank you. Thank yeah, you I'm so much. I... Wow. Thank it's you. okay. It's okay. You're welcome. There you go. Oh, okay, so. I have it. Let me help you up. There you go. Thank you. There you go. Sorry. Thank your, you. your bag? Yes. Oh. You know, I never really asked you what happened. But you know, some other time. Yeah, it's a very long story. Right. But you get to hear it. Sure. Sorry about this. Thank you so I, much. I, I just completely forgot. I know. I oh my goodness. Yeah, it's fine. It's okay. No, it's all good. Baby, your food is here. Thank you, I'm not hungry. <sighs> Come on, babe. You have to eat something. You haven't eaten in days. How is everything eating in this present condition? I've lost everything. <sighs> babe, you're alive and well. You'll definitely regain everything you've lost. How? The bank has taken ownership of everything I own. The cars, the houses. The shop, how? Oh, in a matter of this, I'm leaving, I'm leaving this place. How do I start? As long as there is life, there is hope. Do not lose hope. You definitely bounce back in no time, by the grace of God. Amen. Amen. Babe, don't worry, everything will be fine, okay? You can move in with me if you don't mind when the bank comes for the house. I know my house is small, but I'll manage. Thank you so much, babe. I spoke to my friend and it's cool with me moving in with him. Okay. So, can we go now so you eat something, even if it's little? Please. Come 
treating you like a king that you are. Even because of you. <laughs> What's up with Obi? How are things with him? He's dispirited. Just try my best to try to make him not lose hope. I really feel for him. You know, it's not easy to see your entire life flash before your eyes. He will definitely bounce back soon, by God's grace. Amen. Amen. So, how is Pearl and Sochi? Oh, they're fine. Pearl hasn't been around for a bit though. She, she's with her grandma. So, you've been home chilling? Mm, not exactly. I've been going there to keep Sochi company. Hmm. You have been going there to keep such a company. I talk and sing her from club, but they take enter dance. You don't enter dance, more small. You this girl. Please, please, it's nothing. It's yeah. nothing. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> you know, really, ever since you came into this home, you've brought nothing but joy. And I really thank God the day you walked in. You know, after my wife passed, there's always been this vacuum in my heart and I always said, there's no woman who can ever feel this. But I was, I was wrong. I was wrong. The bank is coming to see the property tomorrow has not agreed in the contract. So there is nothing I or anyone can do at this point. <sighs> what if I loan you five million naira? At least to pay us deposits first. You want to loan me five million naira? I'll give you more if I have. That's like my life savings. Thank you so much, babe. Well, we're talking about 300 million naira here. The bank won't take that. The least they will take is 40%. So, what do we do now? I don't know. I don't know. Honestly, I, I wish I knew. when you were chatting and smiling like this. Who are you chatting with? I hope it's who I think it is. Who do you think it is? Who else? Sachi, of course. <laughs> oh, well, you're right. Sachi and I are friendly and I think. Oh my God, Lucy, you're a bad friend. And you didn't tell me about it. I'm sorry. I, I was going to. Okay, you're sorry. You were going to. Okay, that's fine. I want to hear all of it. How did it happen? 
how did he ask you out? Have you guys kissed? Have you guys Should done they? it? <laughs> More questions at a time. Okay. I want to know all of it. My blood is hot. You like just too I much. I love it. Yes, I love it. <laughs> Give me the full gist. Okay. Oh. Yeah. So, um, I mean, you know, obviously, I've been seeing him a bit more frequently okay. since Pearl's lessons got a bit more intense. Mm. But then recently I went there and she was at her grandma's. So, yeah. Mm. And then he was being nice. Mm. Just little chit chats here and there. And yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just I can hear it. Just... <laughs> can you see? I'm just watching you. But like, my friend is in love. <laughs> I guess you could say that. Yeah. But yeah, he said he liked me. Mm. And yeah, just been mm. talking a bit more. <laughs> oh my god! Oh. I feel like falling in love again. I know. It's so sweet. <laughs> what are you in love? I'm fine. Mm, how's grandma? She's fine. I missed you. I missed you too. Mm. I brought you something. You did? Yes. Okay, what is it? Give me a minute. Okay. Babe, have you already told her? I don't know what the both of us do it. Come on. Great. Pearl! Mm, thank you. They're lovely. so lovely. Yes. Do you like them? <laughs> I love them. Yeah. Thank you. Come sit down. I want to talk to you about something. Does Miss Lucia want to resign? Um, no. No, she doesn't. It's actually something different. What is it? Take your time. I'm about to tell you something. <laughs> All right. You, you know, um, after mommy passed, I, I haven't had any best friend. Not a man, not a woman. And um, it's just you and I in the house. And I'm going to miss mommy so much. I have mommy in my heart forever. This car will always be there. But right now, Miss Lucia and I are best friends. And best friends are always going to be together. So you're going to be seeing her more often these days. Even when you don't have classes. And, you know, best friends sometimes grow. And sometimes they get married. So maybe Miss Lucy and I will get married. So, what do you think? Yeah. The two favorite people in my life after my mom are finally together. I'm happy. 
Are you happy? <laughs> really? Oh, thank you. Thank you, Belle. Honey, flights in an hour. Oh, what's, what's the cup guy? They should be here by now. Yes. Okay. She's still not a car. What was wrong? It was him, babe. It was him. What? It was, this was the guy that knocked me down. It was you. Oh my mother. I'm not the one. I never knocked anybody for grand before. I remember. I remember the plate number. I remember the car. Madam, not in you. Okay, how long have you been driving this Honey, car? Uh, I'm not the one. Oh, you please back up for me. Please, Honey, stop. Me. I'm not the stop. one. I never <laughs> go back to the car. Don't talk about anymore. Like back to the car. <laughs> Honey, catch your breath. Catch your breath. <laughs> what are you? What is? What are you? What is it? This guy knocked me down, and just and just left. I remember it very clearly. When and where did this happen? It was it was April this year, second of April. I can never forget. Adimola de Tokumo. We was we said to I remember everything and this he just hit me and, and disappeared. He's the one who put me in this position that I'm in. It was him. I remember. It was stop. I remember. Honey, stop! Stop! It wasn't. How can you be so sure that it was It wasn't Musa? Probably it was a car, but it wasn't Musa. Okay. But I'm sure it was me. Come on. Hmm? Ah. Oga, so chiku money. Are you in the state? Ah, yes, Oga. Are they close, Oga? Listen, I'm very late for a meeting. You have to be here in two minutes. Okay, Oga. Are they come? No, 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 no. Please hurry. It's myself. I am pressed. Sir, right, right now? I'm in a hurry. Sorry, sir. 
the thing I took one means, the thing they were holding me for belay. Yeah, I'll be there, I'll be there in like, I'll be there in about 10 minutes. I'm sorry, just hold them up for me, okay? Okay, thank you. I'll be back soon, sir. No, sir, I don't have to, I don't have two minutes to waste. I'll be quick, sir. Okay, sir, I'll be quick, sir. Hurry up, sir, hurry up. Okay, sir. to do now. Report to the police. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry to see. It's okay. I've been hurt. I've been down. Fell with my face to the ground. I looked up and called out. What's wrong, Dad? Ever since I came back from school, you've been acting strange. I did something bad to Miss Lucia. What did you do? Please, can you just calm down? At least, can, can you just come down for him to come back? Let him just come back before. Madam, you have to look such rights. It was my sister's idea. She believes most women get into a relationship because of their partner's financial status. I don't believe that about you, but I had to feed her curiosity. I had to prove to her that there was one woman who was not in that category and that lady 
as usual. I'm sorry for any inconvenience I may have caused you. But right now it's clear to me that you make any situation better. No matter what upsets me, no matter what I'm worried over, you're always there to make it better for me. And that isn't it beautiful. My name is Shadi, and for the rest of my life, I'll look for the right words to tell you why I love you. Let me have the room, please. Thank you. Will you marry me, Shadi? Yes, he is. your husband my husband <laughs> Pearl how are you I'm fine I've missed you told me what he did. He's very sorry. Please forgive him. Well, it's, it's not that easy. I lost my entire modeling career because of your dad. Like you said, in life, no one is perfect. We all make mistakes. If only we could turn back the hands of time, we would do things differently. But we can't change the past. We can only change the future by what we do with the present. My dad is very sorry for what he did. Please forgive him. Don't let the weight of the past hold you down. Lucia, please forgive me. Please. It's okay. I've forgiven you. Thank you. Thank you so much. You make me the happiest man on the planet. Will you marry me? Yes, I'll, I'll marry you. We cannot change the past. 